Right there, and you see right there on that motorcycle? We were in um, Port Site, and he gave me a very outstanding ring. It looks like an ear of corn. Turquoise and all these little colors. And it was just beautiful. Now, now, I said, I can't afford to have that rough bean fresh with me. So, I gave him a fancy oh. ring. And gave Al the ring he gave me. Al wears it. But well, we went to Nashville. He, that man took us to his house. David Allen Thomas. And we used to meet every Tuesday night right below Reba McIntyre's house out in Goodlettsville. Al and I and all the musicians would meet out there. And that's how we got so close to Bill Monroe. Bill Monroe was a playboy. And I used to watch him messing with the girls. I said, Bill, stop it, stop it. Girls, I said, I'm watching you going from girl to girl to girl. And when he shake your hand, he squeezes it real tight. And um, like Bill Monroe would just shake your hand like he meant. And that's where we met him, and he wanted us to go up to entertain his sister who was dying with cancer in Rosine, Kentucky. And that's where we went, and when we did the performance at her house, we went across the street to the old barn where his Uncle Penn taught him to play the mandolin. And the Rosine, Kentucky newspaper wrote a beautiful article. They sent it to us after we got back. And Al and I were very, I don't know how to say it, but it means something.